Okay, I'll just show you how to delete a mobile from the Bluetooth audio system in this 2018 uh, Ford Transit. So uh, let's just go back to radio, turn that down. So from any screen, you've got sorry, you've got phone there. You've got menu up at the top here. If I go to menu, you've got sync settings, sync applications, and I I always go to use this uh, the volume control, but we need to be using these arrows. So you see there, that, that takes you down the menu. If you go to phone, you see there, searching for best paired phones. Um, so the, there is, there's nothing paired at the moment. If you click there, these, these correspond to um, the bottom, these bottom buttons correspond to the, the instructions on the bottom of the screen, add, delete, connect. So that's add, delete, connect. So anyway, we'll, we'll just, we'll, we'll go back to, um, Go back to menu and then we'll go to sync settings you've got bluetooth on if you're having trouble setting uh, or pairing your bluetooth to the the vehicle then um, make sure there's a tick in that bluetooth on and then we just go down to bluetooth devices there's an arrow at the side click the arrow at the side or the arrow that way and then i just want to go down to barry's phone and that's my phone highlighted at the bottom you can see add delete connect and master so we want to delete it so I'll click delete delete various iPhone and then you've got yes there and no there no if you change your mind yes if you want to get rid that's it gone okay I'll just show you how to pair a mobile to the Bluetooth audio system in this 2018 Ford Transit first of all we make sure Bluetooth is on oh on to settings on to Bluetooth and then we're watching out at the bottom here now if I click on phone, it's got add or cancel. There's no phones paired at the moment, so it's allowing me to add one. Click add. Search for sync on your device and select sync once it is found. So that's a bit loud. So sync's come up there, so we select sync. Confirm that the pin displayed on sync matches the pin displayed on your device. 320489 pair. So yes, it does. And we just click you've got yes there and no there so yes it matches allow contacts and favorites to sync allow sync connected so it's showing and then for your iPhone. safety please stay alert to changing road conditions and use sync's voice activated features while your vehicle is in motion download phone book I don't want to do that because I won't be using this again um, that's it that's how you do it okay I'll just show you how to stream audio through the Bluetooth system in this uh, 2018 Ford Transit um, so the phone is already paired to the vehicle so if we now go to music click music there there's a record playing it's turned down at the moment but if you click there sync at the bottom that shows you you've got a choice between iPhone and sync so there's a tick next to sync. That means anything that plays on this phone, any audio uh, from a YouTube video, um, from Spotify, from Amazon Prime Music, and from iTunes, so long as this is set right or the, the correct buttons are clicked, then it will play. So it's playing. We go to the music, over to the system, and you've got your auxiliary button here four buttons down auxiliary again i'm going to turn this down i just have to wait for it to the screen to go back click auxiliary and that's it. it that's the record it's playing if i turn this up now actually i'm going to have to click play there but uh, if i turn this up now that music on my phone will be playing through these speakers so we'll turn this up and then i'll turn this up quickly so that's it that's how you do it okay I'll just show you how to set the sat nav in this 2018 Ford Transit uh, from any screen here actually I'm going to turn that down otherwise music will play when I try and show you so any screen onto nav click nav and you've got there zoom move stop mute so I'm just going to click stop actually because it was already uh, navigating me to a place so that's the route then we want destination input again we use these arrows not this uh, volume control so arrows destination input click OK 
city and postcode that's what we want so we click OK and then again I'm going for this volume control but <laughs> you use the arrows so we want Grosvenor Garage, Chorley Road, Watney Dale, Preston so that's P so you select the letter and then click OK we need numbers now the numbers come up at the bottom the five this one even though we've only got two digits we don't have to put a space in some you do so be careful of that or be mindful if you get to the, the first two letters and then one number uh, and it won't let you go any further it's because you need to put a space in then another number and then the, the last letters so select four and then up to J oops so PR54 J the last one is S click S PR54 JS that's the one we want and you've got OK keyboard backspace or cancel click OK and then we click start you've got start store coordinates and map click start eco I just want to get there I don't I don't want it's like having a test in an exam continue to follow the road that's it that's how you do it